This is a Van der Graaff generator, which I showed in a previous video. As you can see, the top bowl isn't on. I've made some improvements to it, and I'm going to show you guys those improvements. First of all, I'm coupling the motor to the Van der Graaff generator using a pulley. The band is a rubber band. There's the motor, and that's a tinker toy. It seems to fit the rubber band. See how the rubber band goes inside it? And there's the plug for the motor. Here's the top part of the Van der Graaff generator. That's the top roller, which is PVC covered in aluminum tape. The belt is an exercise band. That's a copper wire used as the brush. The copper wire is frayed. This is the lower part of the Van der Graaff generator. This is a flange attached to the wood, and the PVC pipe is stuck in it. I can take the PVC pipe out if I want to make some changes to the bottom of the Van der Graaff generator. Now I'm going to show you guys what it looks like in action with the pulley. So I'm going to plug my motor in soon. There's the motor. There's the tinker toy wheel. There's the top bowl. Here's the plug, and I'm going to plug it in. So you can see the motor spinning, Tinker Toy spinning, which spins the rollers in the belt. I made a discharge wand by attaching an alligator clip to a soda can with a skewer inside to use as a handle. And what I do is I attach my alligator clip to the, the bottom brush of the Van der Graaff generator, and that's it. Pretty simple. Thanks for watching.